This video is about the events surrounding the foundation of the Federal Republic of Germany. West Germany was founded in 1949, four years after the Second World War. Involved were the winners of the war, the United States, the United Kingdom and France, as well as the Soviet Union. First Chancellor was Konrad Adenauer and first President of Germany, Theodor Heuss. After the Second World War, Germany was divided into four occupation zones and the Soviets started to establish satellite states in Eastern Europe. So that was the first stages of the Cold War. And the Western powers felt the pressure of the occupation of Germany. So with regards to the financial burden and the threat from the East, they, they thought and asked themselves, why don't we create a West German state as a buffer zone, if you will. But before we come to this, there was actually quite early some kind of self-government to a certain extent. Because the German states were founded um, in 1946 and 47, And at the end of 1947, there was the last attempt to find a pan-German solution. But this went wrong and it was very, very obvious that there's a division between the Western powers and the Soviet Union. So, the United States, the United Kingdom and France met with the Netherlands, Belgium and Luxembourg um, and decided, all right, we will found a German state, a West German state, which is democratic, federal and firmly integrated into the West. On the 21st of June 1948, the Deutschland was introduced. So now we have the monetary economic precondition foundation for uh, a German nation state. The Soviets responded with the Berlin blockade, but West Berlin never fell because um, France, the UK and the US supplied the city, the free city, through the air. The military governors handed over the Frankfurt documents to the minister presidents. The, military, the Frankfurt documents are uh, stating the ideas of the Western Allies of a constitution of a German state. So the Parliamentary Council convened, formulated the constitution and they came up, came up with a solution on the 8th of May 1949. The German states ratified the constitution, the Allied approved, Bonn was declared or proclaimed capital and then in the night from the 23rd to the 24th of May the German constitution took effect now, many historians say that is the birth of uh, West Germany. In August 49, the first parliament was elected and convened in September. Theodor Heuss was elected president and the parliament elected Adenauer first chancellor on the 15th of September 1949. His inauguration was on the 20th of September and now other historians say this is the birth of um, West Germany. On the next day, um, the occupation statute came into effect and this statute secured rights to the Allies. They had the right to intervene in German foreign economic and security policies. Now, further developments. In October 1949, the GDR, Eastern, uh, the Eastern German part, Eastern German state was founded. Germany, West Germany, um, could extend her sovereignty through the treaties of Paris and the internal, full internal sovereignty was reached in 68 when the Parliament, German Parliament adopted the emergency laws. The full external um, sovereignty, so under international law, was achieved on the 3rd of October 1990 with the German reunification. The foundation of a West German state was the basis for the development to become a fully sovereign country as just shown. Also, it's of course the precondition for the integration of the West and the NATO membership of Germany. And without the German state, there would probably never been the European Community and the European Union of today. A, GDA, a GDR was found and there was the division of Germany for 40 years. But also, of course, in the end, as shown, there was the German reunification. That was the foundation of West Germany in five.